Alright, so tonight, so tonight I'm going to do a quick review of this pen, Twisby Eco. I've had the pen now for about a month. I feel pretty comfortable with it. I have a good amount of seat time with it at this point. I use this pen at work probably three days a week or so now. It splits time between this and my Lamy 2000. Um, those are two main ones. Sometimes I bring, um, what's the last one? Another pen that I bring pretty regularly, but I, especially since I've gotten it, I've been using using the Twisby Eagle a lot. Um, mine has a fine nib on it. Uh, I really like the way the pen looks. It's a good size, feels good in the hand. It, it writes excellent, cons especially considering the price. Uh, my only real question with this pen was the durability of it, especially considering, you know. Twisby, some of the issues that they've had with their, their plastics cracking. Um, and I've only had it for a month, but where I work is a, a pretty harsh environment, very fast moving. Um, and so I put it through the motions for a month now, and I'm, and I'm pretty impressed with what I've come up with. The pen looks like the day I've got it, for the most part. There's a little bit of scratching or scuffing on the, the chrome band that is around the cap there um, and I have dropped this pen and, and like drop slash kicked it from full height numerous times at this point and it still looks really really good um, there's a very slight amount of scuffing but the especially impressive the the plastic has held up amazing the uh, the white plastic and the cap, I mean, I have really beat this thing up pretty good. And, and the top of the cap here still looks like new. There's not even any black marking or anything. And I thought that with this white, I was gonna get some some marking and I figured, hey, I'll buy another one because it's it's cheap. Um, but I haven't yet. Uh, you know, the, bat, the bottom still looks good. The clear plastic is still perfectly clear. This is like blemish free. There's like nothing visible at all in terms of imperfections. This pen's a piston filler. It's a 28 or so dollar piston filler pen, which is unparalleled, I believe, in the industry. It works awesome. Um, it's beautiful, the mechanism. This pen is essentially a demonstrator. So whatever ink you put in it, that the pen will assume that persona at least for that day. Um, and the piston is operates smoothly, but firmly, securely. Uh, the, nib, the knob moves around here, but you, you reach resistance on either side where you have to really kind of turn it or else it will not uh, hurt in order to operate the piston. Um, some people have had issues with them, with these pens posting. Mine posts pretty solid. Um, it did post better when I got it, I will say. I'm not really sure what's up with that. I guess maybe this O-ring in here seats a little better than it comes from the factory. I'm not sure. Um, it does It does post pretty good. If you do want to write with the pen posted, I mean, it's it's not going to come off. It's it just, if you knock it off, it'll come off. But I feel like almost that any pen is like that. So anyway, I just want to do a quick writing sample for you now, show you what how it writes. I, I got a fine nib. It writes awesome on the uh, cheap copy paper that we use at work, and that's why I, let, I use it a lot. The only thing I wish is just for, for daily use. I cap and uncap my pen probably five times a minute at work, and this one is a, a threaded cap, so I do have to unthread it instead of just the Lamy is just a pull and you're done. But I will say the threading, uh, a thread to cap on this is very satisfying. It's, it's very um, deliberate. When you when you twist this thing, you can. I mean, this cap is durable. You can slam this in here and twist it, and it's twisted in there, and it grabs. It's it's not like it just reaches a point and it clicks. It kind of slowly gives resistance, and it twists in there, and it secures itself, and it's very secure. Uh, the cap is also, or the clip is also nice. You know, it's a little bit stiff, honestly, but you get that on your, your pants pocket or wherever and it's not going to come off. So let me do a little writing sample quick, show you how it writes.
Thank you.